Sam. Snow White is on her way to the forest, carrying a lot of food. What a beautiful day! The weather is warm, the sun is shining, and everyone is happy. Snow White looked round. There was no one around except for the frog and herself. Huh? Where is everyone? Everyone fled to avoid the approaching rainstorm. This frog is about to go home too. But there is not a single cloud. Do you really think it's going to rain? Snow White, didn't you notice the warning signs? You're right. Although there are no clouds, there's something strange in the air. It started drizzling already. I think the evil queen has something to do with it. We must stop her. It might be easier to stop her if we find out why she's doing all this. Okay then, let's find the queen. Do not worry, my friends. We'll save you. Do you think she is doing that because it's summer and everyone is happy? She won't let anyone have fun if she's not having fun. We should find a way to entertain her. Maybe she's trying to fill her swimming pool. I don't think so. She would have magically drawn water from the lake to fill the pool as she did last year. Don't you remember the drought she caused in the forest? Yes, you're right. And she didn't even like the lake water. Drain this water from my pool immediately. Okay, let's go find out what her problem is. If it continues raining like this, we'll be underwater this time. The rain got heavier as they approached the Queen's castle. Oh, look! The moles are in trouble! Snow White, our homes are flooded! Get out of your houses right away! We're going to stop the witch! You'd better hurry, Snow White. You're right, my friend. Let's go, Doc. As Snow White and Doc walked towards the castle, a rabbit came running up to them. Hi, rabbit. What's wrong? Our carrot field. If we don't pick the carrots on time, we'll starve this winter. Let's help them collect the carrots now. Thank you so much, Snow White and Doc. I hope you can stop the queen. If we can get past that puddle, we can put an end to all this. You can go through the vine garden over there. Thanks, Bunny. Doc, I'll have to carry you so I can go faster. After a difficult journey, they finally reached the castle and quickly went up to the Queen's room. Hey, 
Do you realise how many animals you have put in a difficult situation? What do you think you're doing? How dare you enter my castle? The whole forest is about to be flooded. Why should I care? Stop the rain? Impossible! Why is that? I still haven't had my morning tea. Doc, I didn't get it. What is the witch trying to say? Did you understand? I don't get it either. You are so ignorant. Best teas are grown in areas where it rains a lot. What does that even mean? It will rain and the tea plants will blossom so that I can brew the most delicious tea. The mirror didn't give you the correct information. Tea can't be grown with rainfalls like this. What? Why not? Mirror? Is Snow White right? But you didn't ask for how long. Mirror, I'll put you in a room where you'll never get to see beauty again. So you caused all this for a cup of morning tea? Of course! Morning tea is important! Stop, dog! At least we now know the reason for all this. I'll bring you the best tea, but first I want you to stop the rain. Hmm, I'm not sure if I can trust you. The dwarves are famous for their tea. You can count on us. Okay then, I'd like to have my tea. The rain has stopped! Hooray! Hooray! The rain has stopped! Hooray! Hooray! The rain has stopped! Hooray! Get moving! It's almost tea time! That's a very unhappy woman. But I know what kind of tea I should prepare for her. Let her drink the tea of goodness and see. <laughs> That's a great idea, Duck. 